Carly from the Wisconsin Humane Society yeah. brought Ricky, six month old, very well behaved. He's been very calm <laughs> early this morning, kind of relaxing. I get it, buddy. It's early. I'd be taking a nap if I could too. Oh, you are so sweet. Why don't you tell me about Ricky? Yeah, so Ricky is six months old. Um, he is neutered, mm -hmm. microchipped, and vaccinated. And a good boy. And he really is. Um, and he's going to be available for adoption when we open at 11 at our Milwaukee campus. Okay. But he walked all the way in here on his own yeah. with leash, of course. But mm -hmm. he walked. He's been, he really has been great. Yeah. Very um, mild tempered. He, he was a little shy at first. He warms yeah. up to you pretty quick. He does. He's yes, got he does. Four socks. I love his coat. <laughs> Sheds a little bit, but uh, he's, yeah. he's a pretty good size. I mean, you know, for six months. Yeah, it's hard to know how big he'll be. We don't know Always what he hard. is. Yep. So it's really hard to know, but he could be a good sized kid. I was just telling you, he's a mutt, so he's half terrific, half awesome. Yeah, exactly. What I tell just like your dog. <laughs> about my dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't tell him I said that, though. Um, what else did you want to talk about? Jumping yeah. could be a problem. I, I'm, my dog's guilty of this. Yeah. It's hard when someone first walks in or you just meet them, you know, they get excited. It's very hard to keep their attention. What can exactly. we do? Exactly. So there are a few key things that you can do to help start working on that. Mm -hmm. The most important one is actually when a dog jumps, simply turning your body away. Mm -hmm. um, you don't want to push them off. That's kind of rewarding or giving them that attention they like. So you let them slide off your body when you turn away from them. And then as soon as they have all four feet on the floor, you reward that. Either crouch down yep. and pet them or give them a treat. Um, and then enlisting family and friends to help. That's a big one. If you don't have a lot of visitors over, right. getting people to come over and, and work with you, get on the same page, and then also teaching a dog to sit when they say hi to someone. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's really hard to jump when they're sitting. Right. And those are good ways to kind of get you started. But the most important is simply turning away when they jump on you. Uh -huh. And over time, they really want your attention. They start learning that that's not what they should do to get it. Yeah. He's kind of lounging, leaning up against he you. He is. He's a real relaxed, relaxed kid. Yeah, he is. Uh, huh. Would you say a good amount of energy? I mean, would you get him going? I think he will he because we were lot, playing yeah. outside in the studio, yeah. and he, he definitely is. He likes toys, soft toys, playing long walks will probably be something he'll love when he gets yeah. older. He's uh, he's got uh, Eden. I think he's got your attention early this morning. <laughs> so uh, he, he's one of the dogs available for adoption, but you guys have plenty of other animals. Yeah, we do. Yeah. We absolutely do. There are a lot of other dogs. You can check out our website mm -hmm. at wihumane.org. There's also more information on there for our behavior department if you have other behavior questions yeah. that you need help with. Well, perfect. If you're interested in adopting Ricky or any other animal, you can head to the Wisconsin Humane Society Milwaukee branch. That's 4500 West Wisconsin Avenue. We have more information posted on our website, wisn.com.